Hey everybody, JPT back with Knights of the Old Republic here on Tatooine. We're going to be talking with some of these guys, these hunters. Hello, human. Are you a hunter like the others here? Not the life for me, but I admire you for it. Well, what do you do? I fill the days with games of Bazak. Not that there's many people to play with, but a person should be keep busy somehow. I play with that fellow in the cantina, but I find him distasteful. Me too. He beat us. He does not play for the same reasons I do. Why do you play? The sport of it. Even if I lose, there's reward in having played the best of my ability. I don't dwell on the credits taken or given. I like this guy. To most people, the game is simply gambling, but I choose to get more out of it than that. Not many players see it that way. Ah, see, we're finding those spelling errors. Uh, let's have a game. Warm up. I'm up for it. I haven't played you before, so let's slow to start. Low wagers just to see how we measure up. Bet what you wish. I prefer the sport. All right. 75. Oh, that's low. Um, let's just play with this one. Mm, yeah. Ooh, we got a good... Uh, didn't get some ones and twos. I would have appreciated that. Uh, let's end the turn. So we got a 10. Come on, another 10. Oh, 19. That's perfect. 14. 19. Aw, oh, you jerk. Two, one, he's got 14, 19, so he's probably going to hit it before we do, so he hit 20, 10, 13, 18, well, it's not going to hurt us, Ooh, 19, why not, yep, we can't do that, it's probably the most cards I've ever gotten, never filled out nine before though. Uh, five, so we got eight, eleven, oh, he went over, and he's got another twenty, nineteen, well, I can't do that, see what I mean, you gotta have those ones, nine, thirteen, I should have maybe played my six there, ah, shoot, let's flip it. Try that again. Oh, he's got 16 as well. 21. Shoot. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. Heard any rumors off planet? Nothing says that unfortunate business on Terrace. The Republic is reeling from that, as are we all. It is troubling. But you can't let that call. I call a stop to your day. We survived worse and will again. It's just the way things are. It's true. Safe travels. Yeah, take my money. Punk. There's this guy. Oh, you're so sad. We can't talk to you. Look at the hiccups all of a sudden. Get lost, Tenderfoot. I hunt Desert Raid. I don't babysit. Come on now, I just want to benefit from your experience. It is just as well. You probably couldn't teach me anything. I'm going to say that. Hoping to goad me into talking a bit? All right. <laughs> what do you want? Mm. Who knows the planet best? You'll have to ask around. Comad Fortuna is a much more experienced hunter than I am. He hunts far from Anchorhead. The local Jawas are a good source of information. Everyone keeps telling me that. Even if it is crazy. hard to understand them. It may cost you, though. Who are you? My name is Doric Quinn. I'm a hunter. I hunt. Is that enough, or should I start listing my family birthdays? This guy's a jerk. Where's the best hunting? If I knew the best place, why would I tell anyone? It would be worth too Pretty much sure to, we have to, to fight let it a... get out. It doesn't it matter. Ca 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 this season has been dry for me, ca as it has for almost dragon? everyone. Perhaps someone else is holding out, but there are simply fewer raid out there. Why are there fewer raid? It used to be a one-on-one -on -one test. Hunter against hunted. Now people just want the credits. I could stomach maybe a pair or a team of hunters, but some now use battle droids. <gasps> Where's the sport in that? Who uses battle droids? That's not for me to say. I won't be a troublemaker in so small a community. You'll see. Hunt, and you will see. So if we had actually came in here 
the battle droid thing would have made more sense, I guess. Because we already saw the guy with the battle droids. Uh, so how long have you been at this? I've tracked wild beasts my whole life, but I've only been hunting here for five years. That guy doing I have the much background. To learn He's yet. like laughing at nobody. He's like, oh, oh, oh. Uh, what do you want to learn? There are hunters that go after the big kills, the crate dragons. Crate dragons. I don't know how okay. they do it. I never even see the things. Comad is the one I respect, but I also trust that the only difference between us is experience. I will learn. What can you tell me about the other hunters? I don't go telling stories about other people. If you want to know what they think, you go talk to them. You seem pretty prepared to hold your own with most of them. I heard what happened with the Gamorians. Good work with them. I think you'll do just fine around here. Oh, good. Um, let's go back to my first question. If that's what you want. Um, I have to leave. Good hunt. Peace out. Oh. Uh. Something you wish, human? Just a few questions. I see no harm in it. There are hours yet before I set back out to the dunes. Who are you? Comad Fortuna, a hunter and member of this lodge. It is not the life for everyone, but I am content. Where is the best hunting? Best hunting is wherever the best hunter is. Good question. Or a good answer. Uh, depends on what you seek. Raid are plentiful in the spoils of a sport hunter. Dragons appear only to the true hunter. Patience is key. Dragons must hunt, al hunt alone, and their prey is whatever can catch their attention. So the dragons are rare? They are both rare and dangerous, and an honor to hunt. If you survive, you are blessed and favored. Respect them. My knees hurt for all like mother. I need to stop sitting down so much. Some try to lessen the risk of by mass hunting with battle droids. I would prefer to hunt solo, taking the risk as my own. I swear I know how to read. Uh, how long have you been at this? A decade? Two? I don't enslave myself to time human. There is a day and there is night. Awesome. You really don't know anymore? Tatooine will not change my, in my lifetime. Why bother trying to keep up with the rolling of the years? Sounds like this guy could use a drink. Um, let's go back to my first questions. I'm looking for something. No one that will return your questions. To truly know the dunes, you have to live there, as the sand people do. Only they truly explore the lands. They attack without debate, if you see them at all. What about the Jawas? The Jawas may know the land as well, but are more interested in trading than talking. They uh, scavenge to do something. The language is difficult. If you can get anything more than the price of a droid out of them, I'll be impressed. Awesome. That's why I love the Jawas, because they're pretty hilarious. And that guy's just sitting down. Um, so let's look. The Sand People. Uh, Circa Corporation. So let's go find them. So we really didn't get much out of those guys there. But hey, it is what it is. Uh, let's see. Circa Office is here. Okay. Wait. Yeah, it's over here. So let's go in here. Let's see if we can get some moisture evaporators. There you go. Greetings again from the offices of Zerga Corporation. Um, I have Gaffy sticks. I see that, but do you have the all-important chieftain's Gaffy? That was what you agreed to get for us. Was it? Just the regular ones for now. Then I'll take those off your hands. Um... I want to ask about our agreement. Yes, we're still waiting for you to return with the Sand People Chieftain's Gaffy Stick. I'll reward you well when you do. We don't have any new information on the subject. It's still possible that they have an enclave in the far south of the Dune Sea. And I would remind you that you did agree to do this task for Zerka Corporation. Uh, there may be a non-violent solution. I should remind you that you were not retained as a diplomatic representative. Well, I had to be. Hunter and should go after your prey as we agreed. You are not authorized to do anything other than deliver what was promised. Wow. Do so, and don't talk of this foolishness again. Jeez. Um, so I don't know. I always feel like the last couple of times I played this, I just had to do the violent. I mean, I just went in there and laid waste to him. I'm yawning, sorry. Um, I was trying to yawn without you guys seeing it. <laughs> Um, but I don't know if I can do that. Very well. Farewell. Journal entry added. Let's see. 
The Circa have made it clear that they are not interested in a peaceful solution to the same people attacks. They want you to kill them all. Well, surely somebody has moisture evaporators. I want to ask about bounties. Not my affair. You want to hunt for Circa? You talk to the protocol officer. Uh, what do you have available? Do you have moisture evaporators? I may, but it's not something I usually sell to spacers. You don't look like a moisture farmer. What do you want to use them for? Um, that's really not your concern, is it? No, I suppose not. It wouldn't have mattered. Well, let me tell you what I have then. So maybe... Maybe, maybe I did it both ways in the past then. I don't know. We're going to go peaceful. To the finest evaporators Circa produces, of course, they only produce one model right now. 400 credits for the pair. I won't break them up. That sounds pretty good. Fine, fine. I'll assume you'll be able to handle the deployment of them. They are surprisingly light. It's a pleasure doing business with you. Do come again. Hmm. Cool. So we have those now, which means we should be able to go and get the same people. Take them to the same people, Chieftain, in the Enclave. Cool. Yeah. I thought we found something at the office. That lady, she doesn't want anything to do with us. At least... Peacefully. So yeah, we'll uh, get these guys their moisture evaporators. Go on from there. So the thing about these new Star Wars movies is that they have a new desert planet. I've always been a big fan of Tatooine. And I uh, always just kind of hope that we'd see more from the Jawas. Again, that Jawa fortress would be pretty amazing to see, but doesn't, I don't know, maybe hmm? are Jawas oh, only on Tatooine? I'll just let you pass. The boys in the office may need authorization in triplicate, but not me. Good hunting out there. You know, do Jawas live on other planets? Have, you know, even with, you know, surely, surely another Jawa has been off a planet. In the sense that this is going to take forever, so I'm glad we have something to talk about. Um, but in the sense of, are they, are, do you only, I mean, of course, actually, I don't know. Is there a genesis to the Star Wars universe? You know, did... Did, or were there humans on just one planet and then they went to other planets or do humans show up on multiple planets something kind of interesting to think about of course once they find ships then they can go to other planets find other alien races and those alien races can go around so I mean it would make sense if Jawas were only native to Tatooine but of course with sort of space faring escapades could go to other planets, but I don't think I've ever seen them, at least in the movies, or in any other location. So that'd be kind of cool. Yeah, just leave it alone. For a second there, I forgot how to control my stuff. Okay, so we've got some corpses here. I think these are guys are just permanent. Yeah. Gross. Yep. So we'll just travel over here to the Sand People territory. And I'm hoping they won't attack us. We'll see. I'm hoping we'll be able to get through the, the door too without getting attacked, but I guess we'll know when we get closer to uh, these guys here. Please don't attack us. Not ready for another battle with you guys. Bantapuru. <laughs> yeah, these guys are going to leave us alone. They'd be attacking us by now. Sand People Warrior. Are you the ultimate Sand People Warrior? This must be the person we need to talk to. Even though the layers of wrappings, you can tell this same people warrior is disgusted by your presence amongst his people. Extrapolation. <laughs> this guard doesn't appear honored to have the job of greeting us. Well, I've got your moisture evaporators. They're not moisture converters. Translation. <laughs> My favorite. This guy. This, Translation. this guy took a really solid game and just 
as he was took it to another to level. Do. I just love that. <laughs> he's just he's that little bit of comedy that you just need. If you read anything of the same people, chieftains, emotions. It seems that he is surprised that you have returned. Translation. He did not expect us to return, Master. Well, yes, he we wonders did. if we have brought the moisture evaporators. Tell them that we have his evaporators. Translation. <laughs> Why is he leaning in towards us? He does not trust you, Master, but you have done more than any other outsider. Oh, cool. I forgot they we got the stick. Attack, and he grants you his chieftain's gaffy as reward. Nice. Translation. The attacks will be reduced, and he will allow you to explore oh, the Oh, yeah. But be warned, so we can look at the Enclave and find the Jawas. Will result in death. And then usually they attack us. I have a few questions. Protocol. If you truly want this sadly peaceful arrangement to continue, be careful of what you ask. Okay. Ask about the star map. Translation. <laughs> Translation. He says that what nice. you seek is far from here in the eastern oh, dune cool. sea. He will give you a map so you can find your way. Translation. His people found it but didn't scavenge it because a crate dragon took up residence. Uh oh, sorry. I was trying to turn down the volume on this a little bit. I'm gonna try at sixty and see if that's any better. Uh ooh, a dragon? What is that? How do I pass it? Translation. Hopefully not through my bowels. Translation. Your ignorance isn't his concern. He claims there is a hunter that wanders the area sometimes and that you should ask him. Translation. The hunter is a Twi'lek. He will be in the eastern dune sea somewhere. Gotcha. So yeah, in the past I've always felt like if I'm talking over the voices it's hard to tell either one of us. And I, obviously if I'm talking, I want you to hear me. So we'll try 60. I think it was on 75 or something before. Uh, ask about the captives. Clarification. We must be more specific. Okay. Ask if he knows the Jawas. Translation. Translation. He says that the captive Jawas are slaves and oh, that sweet. they have lived past their usefulness. You may take them if you wish. Mm, tell him farewell for now. Translation. Don't want to mess with him anymore. Did not think that that would all go down like that. We are free to leave. You are free to leave. Let's see. So, Sand People Chieftain has given you permission to release the Jawas. Got the Star Map location. And Star Map Chief... Or, Sand People <laughs> Chieftain was surprised that you return with evaporators. He will reduce the frequency against Circa and has given you his gaffy stick as a symbol. Take it to the office. Cool. Um, Just to be safe, I'm going to save it here. This is episode 46, 46 episodes. Next time around, I probably won't. I'll probably just have just a couple things that I save because I'm never, the only reason why I do sort of saving in that structure is if I ever kind of want to retcon anything, go back. And that's usually for games like City Skylines and stuff like that. Yeah, we don't want to open up these bins if we don't have to. But with a rag pile. Now oh, we don't need Bantha fodder. Uh oh, he came over here. He's like, what are you doing with my Bantha fodder? We don't want to open up anything that they, uh. Yeah. It, I mean, I must say, oh yeah, these are the ladies. I must say, it is kind of fun to go through here and fight them and find the weird stuff they have collected, but. Not today. What about this rubble? No. Broken droid. What's this? Refuge pile. Nah. Don't want to pick it up unless it's really worth it. Come on, where are these Jabba's at? Where are my Jabba's at? Uh-oh. Corpses. I think they're right here. There we go. You are not the ghostly giants that hold us trapped, the people of sand. You are from the old city new. Jesus must have sent you coming. Are you a rescuer? You must be. 
Same people said you could go. Run to Anchorhead. There are things you must have. The job was under Isis. We'll reward in trade. Find him and you will see. Oh, didn't see what he said there because I clicked. My bad. Coo, coo, coo. Bye bye, Jawas. So we got the journal entry. Fair trade. So yeah, we'll go find him and see what he'll give us. Hopefully, some goodies. Hmm. Can I tr. Nope, I can't go to that. The Evan Hawk from here. How do we get out of here? Is it through here? I think it is. Exit to the Dune Sea. The Dune Sea. Now from here, can I... Yes. Go to the Evan Hawk. It's a lot faster this way, in my opinion. Rather than having to, like, trudge through the desert again, because I don't have any other stuff to talk about. Of course, that thing I said about the Jawas earlier, that could be said with any alien race that's in this universe. Wait, who are you? I hear Zerka is closing their Kashyyyk operation. Nobody's... I know why. Don't even finish that sentence. Greetings again from the offices of Zerka Corporation. I have... Gaffy sticks. I see that, but do you have... Yes. Well, that is a very big headache that you've removed. I'm sure there are still sand people out there, but they'll be quieter now. I think I'll give you a bonus for this. Heck yeah, you will. You've more than lived up to your side of the bargain. Zerka Corporation thanks you. That amount will suffice. I'm sure. Zerka Corporation thanks you her. again. 500 credits. Okay, so we talked to her. Let's see. Sand people. And fair trade. So we need to go find the Jawa. Let's get out of here. See what he has to say for himself. And then I guess we'll have to go find the uh, the dragon. Oh, that's not him. Let's see. Yep, there he is. He's right there. Or is he right there? I'm going to go for this guy. There he is. Okay. Let's click on him. No hands, watch. You of your kind, Isis of Jawa, would like to thank you for what was done. Mine have returned because of you. It is as we agreed, as Isis hoped it was. I have things to give you. Take and be welcome. Looking for a star map. I know this, but it is far away. Oh gosh, dang it, I clicked past him. Already do you have a map of the Eastern Dunes. Follow it and you will find what you need in the Lair of the Dragon. Ooh, sweet. Um, thanks. You're a good friend of the Jawas. We will remember you when you're kind of gone. Ask if you need any more of anything. Awesome. Let's see, so we're done with that one. And now we just need to go to the Eastern Dune Sea. Hmm? Uh, good hunt. Just let me out, dude. Like, seriously, shut up. Okay, Eastern Dune. So, if this is north, this would be Eastern. And so that would be the location we're looking for. This one now. Which I don't seem to recall being there before. But maybe it was. So yeah, this is kind of the, the thing I think the second game did a better job of, is to make you not run so far to places. I don't know, maybe I could I could be completely wrong about that. It could be the fact that uh, I'm just kind of blending the two together. Because there's two very distinct uh, planets that I'm remembering, but I'm thinking... They are from the second game, so I don't want to mention them just yet. And I'll know them when I see them. Um, but I feel like they did a better job at keeping things that you are kind of... Uh, working on. I don't know, I lost my trail of thought. Something popped up in the bottom corner as you saw me look, and it went away. It went away. Let's go through here, and this might, you know, we might only get so far with this before we call it quits, but we'll see what happens. Mm 
the Dewback. What up, Dewback? Can I ride you? Yeehaw! <laughs> Yeehaw! Let's go this way. Let's go this way. Marker post. Marker post. What's this right here? This is scrap. Why can't I do anything with this? Oh well. Oh, there he is. Look at that big boy. Looks like there's a guy right there. Oh, there's a guy right here too. Comad Fortuna. I'm tired of waiting, Comad. How big can this dragon of yours be? I'm going in. <laughs> That's the funniest thing. It's just like they lose their mind. I thought I would see you out here, human. We are hunters, you and I. Perhaps we should pool our skills. I have tracked a very special beast to its lair. Great dragon rests within, and tonight he is the hunted, although by unorthodox means. thought you preferred the solo hunt. That is true, but it is a very critical fight. Bull dragons are rare to see. Rarer still is the apparent something. It seems like this is flying by faster than it was before. It is larger than one of my father felled a decade ago and is too far out of his territory must be dealt with. I might not prevail alone, human, but I must try. So why should we kill this great beast? The natural cycle on Tatooine spans hundreds of years, but there are complications that must be addressed. Complications from your presence, or our presence. Great dragons feed on banthas. If the numbers of either species fall, the other... Oh my gosh. Now settlers use banthas, so there are less dragons to eat. Less four dragons to eat. This one is moving closer to Anchorhead. Perhaps there will be more, but he is the threat tonight. I'd also have if I read everything correctly. I'll help. We must bait the great beast out of hiding and ambush him swiftly. There's no room to engage him in the lair, and his hide will repel blaster fire. I've placed mines around the mouth of the cave. We must coax him out, but this is the end of his season of hibernation. It will take much to rouse him. The food beast this size is almost exclusively banthas and foolish hunters if we are not careful. To lure him out, we must lure his food to tempt him. Well, how would we get Banthas here? Because those are dewbacks in the background. They too have their food of choice. We must find some Bantha fodder. Shoot! To leave the Banthas here. I have a few ideas where they must be found. So it's in their settlement. A vendor at Anchorhead also has some. He had a kiosk in the spaceport. Maybe I bought some. Oh wait, we bought some. If you find fodder and bait the Banthas here, the mines will deal with the dragon as it emerges to feed. Not exactly a glorious hunt, but it will ensure the safety of the region. Seems easy. Well, now the Banthas are in the background. There is one added threat. The same people regarded Banthas as sacred, attempting to feed the herd in this area will likely lead to an attack. Oh, shoot. We are far from the weakened tribes around Anchorhead. The same people of this region are strong, fierce, and will think nothing of killing you. Be careful. Yet more sane people? I've dealt with their kind before. You likely mean the tribe that has been harassing Zerka. This group is used to the deep desert. They appear to be much more dangerous. Look, I have your fodder. Good. Now there is a herd that moves out of the desert. Lead them here, approach them with the fodder, and lead them here. Um, wait, what did I just do? I think I just told him something else. Look, I have your fodder. I'll see what I can do. Okay, so he said the same thing. Let's go around here. Let's go around here. I don't know if we need to click on these guys or, or what. This panther perks up as you approach, obviously attracted to the smell of the fodder you are carrying. The whole herd falls in step. Uh-oh. So either way, they were going to attack us. Um, let's do a force wave, and then just do our normal stuff. Turtle hunter added. So what's that? As Comad said to do, you have several banthas following you, lured by the scent of fodder. You must lead them to the mouth of the dragon. Okay. Oh, yeah. 
Maybe that won't be the last of those sand people. It's gonna be like a multiple step process. Wow, she's bugging out. Achuta. Oh no, Wonga we're good. Achuta. Wonga good job, come talk to me. I tried to do that. Quickly, be ready. The Banthas are in position and will soon stir the restless prey. I hope the mines do their job quickly. Don't worry, I'm ready. Wait, what is that rumbling sound? Oh boy, he's a big one. We'll just do it in this episode. Why not? <laughs> he looks happy. Kind of looks like a big old dog. Uh oh. Oh, I think we're going to need to throw grenades at this guy. Or no, he's going to die. Maybe? Good. We did our part. We did our part. It is done, and the great beast is dead. To my shame, I denied him a final fight, but I honor his memory to make amends. I thank you for your aid, human. You have earned a share of the victory, such as it is. Thanks. We had to be well, had to be done. Just hope you remember there were higher reasons for this. Don't let the spoils be the only reason to hunt. Wealth fades, the sands remain. These are the days of our lives. I thank you for your help here today, human. I shall see you again, I am sure. Cool. Wait, is this our star map? Journal entry. I think it is. Let's get the remains open. Slice and dice. Cut the belly open. Like a tauntaun. Looks like. Whoa. He's gone. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. What did that say? Chewed human corpse. That's specific. Parts. Ooh, is a Jedi Master. Oh, is that the that one guy from uh, the stories when we were on uh, Dantooine? Ooh, some good crystals up in here. Chewed Twilight Corpse. Okay, and finally the star map. Yay, star map! So we have just one more, guys, as far as I know. Korriban, which is a fun planet, which might be the one I'm thinking of. That might be in this game, not the second one. Map, even after all the thousands of years it has been here. Oh, I can feel it. it. Still has tremendous power. Oh, you guys see the guys in the can background? You not feel it? This star map is an artifact of I like the, the little subtle hints the game gives you like that if you're paying attention. May have been drawn here by its dark power, only to be enslaved by it. Come. We should leave this place. There is nothing else for us here. That is true. So there you go. Discovered another ancient star map in the Dune Sea of Tatooine. As before, the map is incomplete, but each map you find fills in more missing pieces of the puzzle. Hopefully, once you find all the star maps, they will give you the location of the Star Forge. So that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Hope you enjoyed. I certainly did. And until next time, this is JPT. Go play your games. And I'll be seeing you 